Hockey! Out of the blue corner, representing the Netherlands, Emma Krapperhaus! Okay, so here we have Ella Krapperhaus. We've seen her not so long ago, back in Alkmaar in December. It was an elimination fight and she has earned her space here this evening to be fighting for the well, minus Ella 54 female world title bout. When her opponent fighting out of the red corner representing Spain, Atenea And here is her opponent, all the way from Spain, Antonina Flores. She's 33 years of age, so four years the senior of her opponent. She's got a little bit of a Muay Thai background, so I'm looking forward to seeing how she performs tonight because I haven't actually seen her on Infusion before, and let's see if she can keep up with that work rate of Ella, very talented fighter. Very good work rate right indeed, and these girls have got everything to fight for this evening. The minus 54 infusion world title bout. It is vacant at the moment, so somebody needs to be taking it home with them. Here she is as she runs down the catwalk, eager to get in the boxing ring. You can hear the crowd getting behind her. Ladies and gentlemen, Atenea Flores! We're well, introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner representing the Netherlands. 16 fights on her record, 12 victories, 3 defeats and 1 draw. Ella Krapperhaus! When her opponent in the red corner, 44 fights on her record, 39 victories, 4 defeats and 1 draw. 12 of her winning fights by way of knockout. From Spain, Atenea Flores! This infusion title fight in the minus 54 kilogram division is scheduled. Five rounds, two minutes. Sponsored by El Shira Stables, Abu Dhabi, when the referee is Mr. Edward Strijkert. So there we go, we've had our introductions by our resident MC, Mr. Tom Westling. So female match here, these girls are in shape. There we have on screen Ella Grapperhaus. As I said, we've seen her in Alkmaar just in December, fighting her way to gain her position here this evening. She fights very talented, Atina Flores. Two minutes, title fight. No elbows, knee to the face is allowed, yes? Knee to the face is allowed, yes? I expect okay. it to Shake be fast and furious. Step backwards. So here we go. Rapper House in the black t-shirt, black and white shorts. Flores in the short crop top with the black shorts. Okay, we the knees. So the, the clinch will suit Flores. Let's see. The traditional armband on the left arm. Flores hard inside and outside. Low kicks from Grappa House. Beautiful right body kick. It's a good catch. Taking away the standing leg. Reaching one, two, good low kick back from Grappa House. Fast returns back. 
one of these girls will be taking that belt home this evening. Everything to fight to for five two-minute rounds. Good low kick, nice attack from Flores there, returning. Well, they're determined to uh, keep the action going, that's for sure. So coming into the last 30. Misses with the inside kick. Very same stature, height. If you catch, you can only do two steps. She would just be reminded there. Left body kick, doubling it up. Doris push it forward, but good work on the back foot of Graffa House. When the end of the first round. Well, there we go, as the girls go back to their corners, and that was quite fast and furious, wasn't it? Grabhouse landing some nice, heavy shots there. Flores, fast returns. It's the tie techniques coming in, the catch and the switch. Um, good push kick there. Excited to see how this one unfolds. Two very fit and eager girls here. Again, putting Grabber House off balance. She was reminded only two steps allowed. So into round two already. Female world title action here brought to you on Infusion Talents, Wuppertal, Germany. That left hook in. Again, a well timed kick from Flores. Grapphaus trying to push forward the whole time. This time, timing was from Grapphaus. Strong one, two goes for the low kick. Needs to walk forward with that so she doesn't miss. Body kicks because Flores is very good at catching them. If she can fake it and bring it up to the head, there will be an opening there for her trying to tip her up again. Good positioning from Grapper House with the guards there pushing on the head. Good for that push kick to off balance Grapper House again, catching that leg. It's so as well, annoying to drag yourself up off the canvas, but she's, she's got to be wary because she caught a low kick then. She's going to leave herself wide open, Flores. And she's reaching down for those low kicks. Grapper House needs to start throwing some right head kicks. Fight! Just waiting their opponent so they can throw the counter, but they need to get involved. Rap House is having the advantage when they come into the clinch with the positioning with the hand. She needs to pull the hip down, pull the head down, try and work some knees, especially to the head. Nice one, two from Flores. Overreaching, needs to step in with her legs. Good counters. Well, there we go. So you go back to the corner. That just, don't know why it popped into my head like tennis, like a volley. So kick for kick. You don't want to be that last person not landing the shot. And that was a nice little flurry from both fighters there. Good work coming in from these girls. Flores very good at catching that body kick. And as I said, there was one she did. Oh, the roly poly there. Caught the leg kick, and she's got to be careful of that because she's got to drop that left hand down so low to catch it. Grab house can bring that kick up to the head, she will land it. So there we go, two rounds down. Felt each other's power, worked out their techniques a little bit. Let's see if they step up a gear now.
Very awkward to throw a and land a single kick. You like the movement of Flores. Upper house finishing the flurry there. Again, catch the leg. Off balancing down to the canvas. Very tiring to drag yourself up. Rapper House edging forward. Beautiful right body kick. A teep to finish from Flores. Keeping that distance just to her favor. Catches the kick. You can see the Thai style really coming through with her. She's got to be careful though, because she brings her, her own head down in that clinch. Grappa House needs to take full advantage of that. Nice one, two low kick. Hard low kick. Grappa House. Gives some of our own medicine back, catching that body kick. Takes in with the hook, straight into the clinch. Throw the Muay Thai background in the knees. In favor Flores, overhand right. Again, a beautiful turn. If you get the technique right, you can do those throws effortlessly. Big right hand as the spit comes flying up. Overhand right from Grappa House, trying to edge forward now. Seconds away. The arms goes up of Flores, and this is a great display of technique, determination, and heart from these girls. We're just having a look at these girls' wide eyes from Grab House there. But good action! It's where she was going to try and grab that low kick. Misses with a kick. Good returns there from Grab House. Fortunately, that leg got caught. And then she gives one back. There we go. Have some of that. So, so, as I already said, this is for the vacant belt, 54 kilograms. My goodness me, 154 kilograms for years. Hard kicks going into the body. Grappa House stepping it up now. Lois comes back with her own strong kicks. Back into that clinch position, trying to put Grappa House off balance. Well, time tip. Tip. Laura shakes her head. She needs to come back. That was a good right hook over the top. Trying to walk down the clinch position, but she's got to throw those knees to get the points in. Swings the right hand. Nice strong jab from Grappa House. Getting involved. There we go. That's that left knee to the face. That's the position you want to be with your guards. Grappa House again aggressive coming forward. He's coming in, looking for the knee. Nice left body kick from Flores. Grappa House trying to get past those legs, delivering her own kicks. Gonna be first to knee. Clinch takes so much energy. Overhand right misses. Big right hook comes around the side of Flores's ear. Rapaz walks into her right hand, but she keeps steaming forward. Got to get the knees in. Last 10 seconds as she really tries to open up the barrage of punches and kicks. A good well timed teep there was from Flores. And she dumps it down to finish the round. 
And what an amazing round from both girls, really stepping it up a gear. Yeah, but what, sorry, every time you fly, you have to go down the Oh, deep breath. As they've got one more round on the scorecard to get the judges' decision for them. Let's have a look. Really good round. Flores shaking her head earlier on in the round there. Grapper House was coming forward. Really nice shots being deli delivered. Good knee control. And there we go. We're seconds out of the fifth and final round of this fight. Well, not nice to finish on the canvas as the bell rings, but we have two more minutes ahead of us to determine who will be taking the infusion minus 54 Five. at the moment. They can belt home with them. So as they collide in the middle and the shots get swapped, both girls are doing a great job. It's really going to be down to fitness as well. Nice left knee delivered from Flores. Grab house looking for that main position with the hand. She's going to have to be careful that head doesn't get pulled down. Flores just got good balance with her footwork there. Got to stand more square on when you hit that clinch position. Pumping right hand over the top from Grab House. Nice push kick. Faking it in with the knee from Flores. Trying to edge forward. Fuel levels are getting low on these girls. They've put a lot of work right in here. Corners encouraging them. Good shots coming in from Grab House's Flores. It's returning the favours back. Into that clinch position. Strong low kick overhand right. Some good knees coming in. Deep breath from Grab House as she really pushes forward, walks into her right hand from Flores. 20 seconds left on the clock. Hard inside low kick. Well, these girls really digging deep. What a great matchup. Well, the end of round five, the end of this fight. Well, a great work rate from both girls. Well, I would like to be a judge. Voss, the CEO of Infusion to the ring, please. So Mr. here we go. To the ring, please. We're going to soon hear the result. Let's have looks for some of the action back and forward the whole time. Really nice kicks being delivered from Flores. Grab House being aggressive, trying to stand her ground. Do like the timing of. Flores, and that was a great time in there from Grab House. Oh, both girls, yep, really good. I wouldn't like to be a judge myself. So as they come to the center. There we go, the infusion minus 54 kilogram bow. Oh, Edwin, the CEO of infusion sporting the infusion mask. So intense time for the girls waiting. No one's quite sure. Well, ladies and gentlemen, of the five rounds of two minutes, we've counted the points and we have a winner. When the winner is the young lady in the blue corner, Ella Kleberhouse. Well, congratulations to Ella. I'm surprised she hasn't got a big smile on her face. It's just sinking in. She is the new world champion.